what's happening everybody amp capo here at black adonis games we are inside unreal engine 5 today man i got a little a little tip if you're having some errors all right um i want to start the video off by thanking everybody who's been subscribing to the channel and all the people that have stayed subscribed to the channel man i appreciate you guys so much what i got going on here is that i've been re uh uh been doing some optimizations and i've been instancing a lot of the actors that are placed all over the map and in the process of instancing what it'll do is it will ask you do you want to replace the actors uh with the current instance that you create and i usually pick yes and now it's a good thing it puts it right where the original actors were all of that works perfect but the problem is is that in this process, sometimes what ends up happening is the uh, original actors get stuck in uh, reference. So that's what you see here. Now, I actually started this video and I have the video where I had like 2,569 of these errors. Okay, so I've already done a lot of them and cleaned them out. And so I'm going to show you guys pretty much um, how um, I uh, clean these errors out. And it's relatively simple once you know where everything is and what you need to remove. All right. So what I want to do now is go ahead and go in. Let's do it. All right. So the first thing you guys are going to want to do is you're going to want to clone your project. So clone your entire project into another folder. Um, clone your entire project and the reason why you're going to want to clone your project is because you're going to need the reference to your uh, message log which you could just copy this whole reference log i'm sure you could just uh, highlight this text and try to copy it or whatever but it's just a lot easier if you're able to clone it it's the best way to do it it's how i got through this relatively fast all right, I've been working on this for a couple hours. I'm not gonna lie, or 2,500, but you're gonna notice that a lot of them are duplicates. What I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna move the list over. So let's go ahead and take the list and we don't need to see the map anymore. I'm gonna go ahead and move the list over. All right, and we're gonna start at the top, which should be where I was at. Okay, so I just finished with the sevens here and I'm going to show you guys basically how I got into this as well. So what I'll do is I'll open another copy of this just um, so you guys can see how I'm getting to the actual folder. Okay, so the reason why I'm picking this folder is because if you read here, it's going to tell you and let me move this out of the way so you guys can see here. All right, and it's going to say basically that this uh, shooter maps external actors, which is a location maps New Zayden, my map, and the location, what file uh, is failing to import for static mesh actor, okay? And the reason is because, as I said before, when I was doing the work and replacing these actors, they were being deleted, but the references, here it is, it's still referenced by this group actor, okay? And so... The, I found out, I've, I've done this once before, but I just didn't do a video on it. Um, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys this now, though. So if you are having these errors, you will uh, be able to tackle that without uh, panicking and saying, oh, my God, now my project has all these errors. And your project will still build. But, you know, when you got errors like this, they're costing you somewhere. So you don't want to have any errors like this. So let's go ahead, guys, and I'm going to show you guys now. If we go back to my original project here, okay, and then remember, I opened a new window to show you guys this. We can go back here to the, this is the project folder, okay? So you want to go into your plugins, okay? And in your plugins folder, you want to go to game features, and then you want to go to shooter maps, okay? That's this first location. And then you want to go into the content folder and you'll see your external actors, see there, and your external objects. Now, guys, you can't just delete this folder. If you delete these folders, your map's going to be blank because basically mo pretty much most of your map is stored as external objects and actors. So you don't want to delete these thinking that you're going to fix this problem by deleting these folders. Don't do that. 
what you want to do though is you do want to go to the one that says external actors you want to go to maps it's giving you and this is why i'm showing you this guys because i want you guys to get comfortable with uh, errors and and reading these errors and it'll help you a lot like it's helped me because from the beginning it was one of my gifts was figuring out uh how to read these errors all right so once again we're in shooter maps which is here external actors all right then we're in the uh maps we're going to open maps and then we're just going to look for our map it's telling us the map here new zayda and lyra click it and now you've got numbers and letters and we are in number eight all right and it's saying dt so now I'm going to go back to my other one that I'm working in because I don't want to be having too many open. So that's how you know how I got here. So now I'm going to go back out and I'm going to click on this and go to eight. And a nice thing is it keeps this stuff in order, guys. It does it relatively in order. You may have to jump back and forth just a little bit in the folder, but everything's in numerical or alphanumerical or numerical alpha order. All right. So it starts off in numerical, numerical alpha and... um. We're looking for DT. So this is folder eight, which you see the number eight there. And then under eight, we're looking for DT. So as you scroll down, it's gonna to change to just numbers, which would be numerical. Then it's gonna to change to alpha numerical, and then it'll just be um, alpha. It'll all be, you know, just regular letters. So we're gonna to go to DT, which is right here. You click on it. And I've been finding out that usually it's the older file. If you see it, the date modified here, this file is older. Don't use this as a way to go through your folders and delete everything because I'm just letting you know that that's how I discovered how mine were. Um, but some of these files I have not uh, done any alterations to. So I will have some of these files that are still old because I haven't changed them since this date. It just so happens these are the files that I'm having you know, that I've changed and deleted are of that same category. And this is the new files that have been logged into this uh, destination folder. All right. So what I want to do is look at the external actor. I just usually look at the last four, last three is good enough. And you'll see that they're the same here. This one is TL2, TL2. All you're going to do is delete that file. All right, and it's going to say it can't do it because I'm actually in the version right now. So I'm going to get out of the version and I have to open the actual other version because it's not going to let me delete it while I'm in here. So I'll be right back, guys, and we're going to open the version that we're supposed to be in so we can continue. All right, guys, so now that I'm actually in the right project, let's go ahead and do this here. I already did 8DT, so I already did that one. So now I'm on 8DX. So we'll go back to 8 here and we'll just scroll down to DX. And the one we're looking for is going to be, uh, looks like QAQ, which is this one. So we'll go ahead and delete it. And that's it, guys. Um, some of these you're going to find, they're going to have a folder and they're the only thing in the folder. I would just leave that there because I believe that it rebuilds it anyway. If I'm correct, the last time I did it, it's going to rebuild that folder. It just uses it to reference something else in uh, the next time you make some uh, external actors that you save. All right. So we're going to go ahead and I'm going to just do a few more of these with you guys before I go ahead and finish all these up. I just wanted to show you guys this because a lot of people I know have uh, gotten these errors. I even see people, some people doing videos and they have this error in their video. So this is why uh, the error is there. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and move on after DX. We're just moving down the list and you can see I'm just reading and I'm just kind of reading this little area, just what I need, just the info I need, which is E2. So we'll go down here to E2, open it up. It's two assets. Um, like I said, I've been finding that it's usually the older asset. See if it holds true here. It's one ZB1, one ZB1. So there it is all right and then we got e4 and some of these at the end they're really close together and you can see this one as this is all that's in the folder um so it's definitely this one just delete it and don't worry about deleting the folder all right 
and then we're gonna go ahead to the next one and like i said guys i'm gonna just do a few more of these okay so we did e4 we're gonna do ee -E. and you can see how the workflow after a while you will just get used to what the workflow is and it'll become easy to you to find it'll become easy for you to find the locations and go ahead and get rid of what you got to get rid of all right and let's see ji So go back, we're gonna go ahead, scroll down. See, that's a nice little jump down to JI. And you gotta watch out because you got J1. So that may actually be J1. Let me take a look at it again. And yeah, I believe it is J1. And I can tell by seeing what it, the, yep, there it is, 3IGP. So that's the only thing you gotta look out for is the I's and the ones and stuff like that. Sometimes they're a little confusing, but besides that, it's relatively easy. We got eight LR and we're gonna go ahead and go to eight LR. And since uh, it's LR, it's, like I said, it's gonna stay in order. You should be able to just go down here and find it. And there you go. All right, and it's going to be this older asset here from 2022. And that's correct. So you just want to keep using this as the reference and making sure you get what you need to get. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and finish all these guys. We're going to open the project up and see if it's clean. I'll be right back. All right, guys, here we are. Uh, reloaded the original project and look at that. Load errors are zero. So literally I took care of everyone and you can see that now I don't have any of those errors anymore. So that's really good. Um, and that's how you take care of that guy. So if you've had that problem or you have that problem now, you know how to do it. Um, like subscribe, tell a friend, man, Amp Capo, Black Adonis Games. Mm -hmm.